theorems and concepts while learning mathematics. Some of us would dread the fact of having forgotten them during tests. But all this has changed. Look at this math lab in progress. Here, apart from learning, children have fun too. They make use of the computer, fiddle with tools that act as aids and more. In Maths Lab, uh, we made a penguin. Uh, our teacher taught us how to make a penguin. Uh, we did some craft without cutting and uh, after, afterwards we unfolded it. We highlighted them with pencil and uh, we identified all the angles. This lab was set up to provide activity-oriented teaching and learning for students. It's called Delta Hedron and it enables creative learning, verifying and visualizing mathematical concepts in a fun way. The surprise element also plays an important role since this makes students curious to learn more. We have observed that children who are scoring above 95 or something, they are fine, they keep on scoring like that. But children who were in their 50s and they have come to their 70s, 80s, that is what the objective is all about because the concepts are gradually becoming clear and they're gradually, the most important thing about maths is the children should love the subject. Another school in the city makes children enjoy learning mathematics through math clubs. Here, you can see students divided into groups headed by a teacher working on mathematic figures. This lets them get a practical sense of what they learn at class. I like coming to math class because math is very t uh, fun in learning and especially they if they use tangrams and teach it's very fun. We can learn fractions using tangram fractions, geometry area, perimeter, etc. So I like math class. The club teaches them to work on riddles, puzzles and tangrams. This makes students enthusiastic about learning the subject and hones their problem solving skills. Basically what happens is whatever concepts are uh, taught in the class is again reiterated in the math club activities. What happens is uh, the children get a better idea about the concept of area, perimeter, their spatial and kinesthetic skills are developed. These developments in the city schools has allowed for math to become an effective and interactive tool to reach out to kids and help in their overall development. Gone are the days when the thought of math classes always terrified and petrified students at school. Today, schools have come out with maths, labs and clubs just like the ones with science in order to make learning maths easy, interesting, adventurous and exciting. Now don't you wish you to had this at school? With camera person Madan, this is Nolan Pinto for News 9.